Hello ladies, it's Penny and it's, um, is it Monday? It is Monday. Monday. Only till midnight. <laughs> it changes again. <laughs> and we're doing another opening for my birthday giveaway. Um, <clears throat> and this one's from the, it already says, my entry from BD. That's Betsy Doodle. So this came this morning. So Arthur's on camera again. Say hello, Arthur. Hello, everybody. BD, I hope you're feeling very, very privileged because you're actually having your card put in my ice cream bowl. <laughs> ice cream bowl. <laughs> so this is me, these. I knew I had a feeling because I recognised the number of the house at the back of the envelope. There we go. Nothing else in there. I will save that envelope and reuse it. Right. To Penny with love and hugs from BD. Oh, she's lovely. Look at that. Isn't she gorgeous? A fairy. She is brave. That is beautiful. Should I take it out? Oh, no, no, I think I'll leave it in. Isn't that lovely keeping it nice and clean in there? Um, I know, I've got to take it out to feel it because it's full of texture. Let me mind that out the road. It's full of texture, as you would expect from BD. It's got beauty. I, I don't know if that's embossing at the back. I'm not sure, not embossing. Um, yeah, embossing powder at the back. And then it's this gold frame. And it's been stitched all the way around and then gone gold on top of that. She's clever, isn't she? Eh? And a beautiful fairy. And she's got a magic wand. And it says she's brave. And then this beautiful pink thread. It, it goes with this slightly darker thread at the bottom ribbon. And yeah, she had stitched all the way around it like that. So that will go a proud place. In my little book, she's beautiful. I love the way Beady does her backgrounds and that. She's she's an expert at things like that. It's beautiful, that Beady. Thank you very much. And she likes all colours. Oh, a little card. This was his home. <laughs> Another that looks like painty paper from BD, and I think these are like Tim Holtz dolls. I called. <coughs> I've never used them, so I don't know too much about them. But I think that's what these are called. They're different textures as well. I don't know how she's got that or ever come like that. No, I think BD's done this extra bit on the dog and on the leggings very effective and she's changed the ribbon to a nice turquoise green to match the background on there and she said she's into numbers at the moment nearly everything she does has got to have a number so this is five two three i don't think they have any great meaning to to betsy but <clears throat> she just decided everything's got to have uh, a number so it is that is beautiful that and again finished off with just a little bit of gold pen around the outside yeah they're they're stuck on top it's not all one page she's got circles out as well and he's got his little dog with him and she likes all colors except white <laughs> all styles fairies cats anything weird piley we know he likes piley making atcs getting painty fingers and johnny depp <laughs> Dislikes white. Yes, we know that. Uh, you get lots of entries in your lovely giveaway. Much love. It's beautiful. That. Thank you, BD, very much. Thank you. I'll treasure them. So BD is number... Here we go. Number seven. So I'm going to fold that up very tight. And pop it in our pizzazz. There are. Pop it in your ice cream machine and there's another one because surprise surprise 
I've got one from Mr. Doodle. Dear Richard, lovely man. I have met him a couple of times, haven't we? We have. Yeah, we have, yeah. And he's a fisherman like my heart, isn't he? Yeah. So, oh, this is, I've never had one from a man before, have I? Could Don't have, look at me like could that. Have, could have been worded better. Uh, oh, wow. Oh, I don't know which to start with. I'll start with the card. Look at that. Eat your heart out, art. That's nice. Eh? Hey, could you do an ACC like that? That's brilliant. Oh, my word. Richard. Beady's going to have to look to her laurels. That is absolutely beautiful. As you can see, we've got lovely black ground paper here. Just looks like bubbles under the sea, doesn't it? <clears throat> can you see all the blues and greens? And then, I don't know how he's cut out all these little fish. Just tilt it towards me. All these little fish have been cut out. And... Uh, that looks like similar texture to what BD's um, little boy had on. Don't know what it is. It's like a wax, a wax resist or something like that on it. This one's got a lovely shimmery tail. I love all this. This is very ingenious, very, very clever. I like that very much. Oh, that's pretty. A little orange goldfish type one and three little... What do you call them? What do you call very small fish? Small fish? No, you don't call them. I tell you what, though. Something. I think I've just found Nemo. Have you? Down there. Yeah. There, there he is. Yeah, there he is. There's hiding. Nemo. Yeah, he's hiding. Isn't that beautiful? What a good idea. Isn't it? Hey? Hmm. That's brilliant. And I'm not forgetting the yellow one there. And again, He's gone over the outline, which looks lovely in the gold. I do like having gold outlines, me. That is wonderful. This is from Mr. Doodle, Rich. Yes, we know where you live. He likes fishing, he likes art, and he likes penny. <laughs> Should be the other way around, Richard. Penny first, and then art. Dislikes working. Not anymore. <laughs> we know he's retired now. And he's enjoying crafting. I think that is brilliant. And from what BD says, he really is enjoying his crafting. And that's wonderful. There's not enough men doing the crafting. And they've come up with, I think, so many different ideas than, um, than what the ladies of crafting does, don't they? You know, it's a new aspect on it, isn't it? That's lovely, that. Absolutely beautiful. And this is his little ATC card. It is beautiful. And, oh, look, she's so sweet. It's got a background. It looks like painted paper at the back. And then loads of butterflies embossed on it in silver. That's gorgeous. And then little gems. I'm trying to see if the gems are... Yes, they are little gems. I wasn't sure if they were um, liquid pearls. Look, three little gem gems there and there and one there. And the little girl is so pretty. She doesn't, she's not smiling, but it doesn't take her away from her prettiness. She is a pretty girl. And he's put her in a lovely pink dress. I don't know what she was wearing before, but she's in a lovely pink dress from Richard. And a little um, flower, acrylic flower in the centre. That's beautiful. Oh, I don't know what it says. Love you to the moon and back. Ah, oh, that's so sweet. Really is. And it's a lovely, good card as well. Oh. Oh. He's put his, um, he's very, I'm very posh. and got his own little stamp at the back now. Look at that. Title, Love You To The Moon and Back, created by Mr. Doodle. The date, YouTube, Mr. Doodle. So he's on YouTube, you can get him out there. IG at Tricky Doodle, location England. That's brilliant, that. Absolutely brilliant. 
Oh, I'm loving them all. I really am. They are gorgeous. Thank you so much, Doodle family. That is beautiful. I'm going to now fold up this piece of paper. That's gone on number eight. Number eight going in. Yes, I am still croaky, ladies. I'm sorry. I'm on my second. I've just started my second lot of... Um, what do you call them? Antibiotics. Antibiotics. Um, I've had to send my spit to be analysed. And Wednesday, is it? Chest x-ray. I've got to go for a chest x-ray as well. It's just not shifting at all. So if I'm a bit behind with the, um, doing any videos and that, you'll have to forgive me. Because sometimes I think, I just... I know I sound, I've not got a good voice anyway, but I know I sound awful at the moment. And plus, I haven't got really the energy sometimes. It's very tiring, this. <laughs> it's very tiring. Thank you very much. They'll go safely in my um, book of ATCs, uh, index cards. And I wanted to show you this. I saw this on... Um, Amazon and it was Amazon and, uh, it's from Greener Books anyway I'm sure so on Amazon and it's called The Victorian Seed by Nicholas Bentley now I was a bit apprehensive not because of the money but because they don't never show you really what's in it there's not enough pictures you know show, depicting what's in and I wasn't even sure of the size. But anyway, it come today and I am absolutely over the moon with it. And I'll do just a quick flip through. Yes, there is some quite a lot in black and white, but that doesn't bother me. <clears throat> some of the pictures are very big, but that doesn't bother me. We can always um, resize them on the printer. Um, it go, I'll do it this way, I think. I've got better flip. That's, that's a nice coloured plate I can reduce. We've got the Prime Ministers. It's just absolute. Look at that. That'll look gorgeous. That need to be a bit smaller, but a bit gorgeous on um, somewhere as that one. And that, to tell you the truth, I'm very enjoying reading it as well. So. It's not just look at I don't just look at pictures, I can read half <laughs> Do you know? <laughs> and I have I do enjoy history very much. Look at that. William Morris, isn't it? That's William Morris, isn't it? Not um Rene. Oh look at that. Eh? Dalton and Lambert Beth. I've got a whole pack with these little things in as well, so that will complement it. Absolutely beautiful. As I say, the, it's jellies and food, what they were eating, how they lived, how they worked, what they dressed. There's everything, everything to do with Victoriana in, that, in this. Look at these lovely portraits. So whatever I use it for, I think it's going to be wonderful. Look at that. Beautiful pictures there. Um, one or two pages I really liked. It had like labels, didn't it, Art? Right, we mm. were flipping through. Where are they flipping out? <laughs> Near the back. Uh, I bet I've gone past them, do you think? I don't know. I might have done. But there was two or three pages and they had like labels in them. Yeah, well, if ever. See if I can see. Look at all them pictures there. Ooh, what was that I seen? Is it this way? Look at them. Brilliant. Brilliant, Emma. I wanted to show you those. Um, I've seen that one. Look at the toilet, how elaborate it is. It was a proper throne, wasn't it? That's why they called it. Sat on the throne. 
don't know if I'm going to see them. There's uh, two pages with lots of labels. Look at them with the hats on. Beautiful. Every time I flip through it, I see something else that I've not seen before. So, I mean, God, if I found this in a charity box, I'd be very, very surprised. But what I wanted to show, tell you ladies was, if you can guess how much I paid for it, you're not going to guess, so I'll tell you. Three pound. Yep. Three pound for this wonderful book. And the postage was free. Would you believe that? Free postage. And it was only three pound. There's that one of them pages. Look at that. Beautiful. And look at this. This is all popular now, isn't it? On, you, on um, the Crafting YouTubes. Um, ATCs with a 50p um, design. So it's old, but it's very modern, isn't it? <laughs> So all of these could be used in things. And as I say, it was three, three pound eight p apparently. I don't know why, and no shipping cost, nothing like that. So absolutely made up. But one weird thing I thought, when was this printed? Well, we found out Arthur and I. It was printed in the seventies, wasn't it? Nineteen seventy one. This particular one. This particular edition was printed in 1971 but i was baffled because when i looked here it said the original price was five pound 25 i thought no way and then this edition sold for two pound 95 so i've been done i paid more i paid three pound and eight p but i mean seriously who would have thought that 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 price, I mean, I know 1971, a long time ago, and I know I was only earning about £5 a week mm. at the very beginning of 1970s. But even so, you know, for a hardback book like that, um, I still think the prices were astounding in them days. So I've got, I'm going to have a lot of enjoyment and it would be a tragedy, wouldn't it, if I, if I cut it up. So there's like, the printing machine. Look at that. It's a cartoon of uh, Victoria on the back. <laughs> I don't know who's done that. Um, so we'll have to get lots of ink in so I can do lots of printing, I think, won't we? Okay. So that's it at the moment, ladies. Another thank you to my lovely friends, BD and... Um, Mr. Doodle, Richard, Rich. I don't think he likes Richard, he likes Rich. <laughs> um, uh, and I'll go upstairs and put these home. And I've got everything. And I know I've got their address in my um, address book. So that's okay. So that's it, ladies. Thank you very much for watching. Have you got anything to say, Arthur? Stay safe, stay, stay well, and keep on crafting. You couldn't have said it better myself. Thank you very much, ladies. Bye, Bye guys. Bye.